everybody, Tom Barnes, Chicago scene down at the Winterfest Village here at Gallagher Way. They also have the Chris Kindle Market happening here, all sorts of things happening. Full holiday experience happening here. I'm going to talk to Lila from the Chris Kindle Market about all the fun things they have going on here. Also mentioning the fun activities, including ice skating, wreath making, the whole thing happening now in Wrigleyville for the Chicago scene. So let's go inside and say hi. Things are happening. It's busy here at the Chris Kindle Market. I'm here with my friend Lila, who is with the market. How are you? Hi, very good. Thank you so much for having me. Absolutely. So this is, I mean, it is sunny. It's beautiful outside. It might not always be like this, so we're going to take advantage of today being as beautiful and sunny outside. And this is the opening day for it. I know the sun is blaring sun in your... Is, yeah. I put my sunglasses <laughs> yeah. in November. <laughs> I know, right? Well, we, it was cloudy like 20 minutes ago. So, but uh, you guys are open. This is the north version of it. You got one downtown and here we are at Gallagher Way, right? That's correct. We have our third Chris Kinner Market, Wrigleyville, at Gallagher Way. We have our 25th anniversary at the Chris Kinner Market, Chicago, at Daily Plaza. Fantastic. So what are the couple of things you want to show us before we get started here? Because I know there's a bunch of things happening here. Yes, so we all know our visitors love the annual muck that's uh -huh. coming out. Here, why are you bringing out a little? Oh, right there is good. Right there's no shadow. Okay, perfect. Yeah. So if it's always a big deal to reveal the design and the shape of uh -huh. the annual muck. This year we have a food shape to go with the celebratory look of the 25th anniversary emerald green you can see the little fireworks everywhere yeah of course, that's the chicago great. skyline the red and white striped wooden booth the original and yes so that one is available at our booth of course online store <laughs> and yeah it's just it's a great collector's item and we know there are some people that have actually been collecting this mark since the beginning <laughs> yeah they for sure have so this is like i know plenty of people this is like a chicago tradition to come right. out get your ornament and then put it on the tree what other couple things you have here before we take our little tour that's our non-alcoholic uh, muck Oh my gosh, <laughs> non-alcoholic beverage mug right uh -huh. here. <laughs> so it's Peppermint the Penguin yep. wearing a little tuxedo to uh -huh. celebrate the mm -hmm. anniversary. And then we also have also we got annual ornament here. Oh, so, cool. so this is new from uh, outside of what we do downtown, right? It's actually in Wrigleyville and downtown. Um, so it's the no, first I mean, year that we're doing this. Okay, first so year. first year because we asked our visitors what <laughs> other kind of collector's item they would love you to spin see. Spin it a little bit. Um, yes, for yeah. sure. And everyone really said, you know, we would love to see an ornament. So here we are with the first annual ornament. Chris Kinner Market hand painted on it. So it's all hand painted, glass blown in Europe. Oh, wow, and, that's um, wonderful. Okay, and so now, Lila, you're going to take us on a little tour, right? We're going to go for a little. Actually, yeah. All right, so you lead the way, and I'm going to kind of follow, and then you can kind of just narrate what we're doing here. So what are we looking at here? So we can see all of our little booths. We're huh? starting the tour over here where the Austrian Lodge is. So here are the things that people can order right here, right? Absolutely. Hi. All right. So yes, you can see them here. And then strudel, very good dessert. One of my favorites. Over there, the apple strudel. Yeah, yeah, I see. Oh yeah, right here, the strudel right here. Yes. Fantastic. So, All right, yeah, so we got this. We got right. this. We have a lot of food Authentic food, food items, yep. So right now we're walking to the, one of the entrances actually, where we have new vendors like um, funds here where you can get plant-based empanadas. Okay. You can see so there's something for everyone. Right. Whether right. you're looking for something vegetarian or you know something over there as we said with the bratwurst, uh -huh. Levi Kiesa, and of course over here. Got the West Town Bakery. Oh, oh, oh yeah, smoke. Yeah. So we got some traditional Chicago things mixed in with the traditional German things, exactly. right? Exactly. We try yeah. to do local international stuff. West Town Bakery right yep. here. Yeah, I saw that one you right saw there. saw that one. <laughs> yeah, for sure. So we make sure, you know, for everyone who has a sweet tooth, there's something, something savory, mm -hmm. local, German, international, a good variety of everything. Right. So you can see here, international from Ecuador, Savalo Inca. Some good sweaters, scarves to keep you warm. Yeah. <laughs> Some local, even some bears and cubs garb for yep, sure. Yep, adjusted to where we are, right? <laughs> <Yep>. Chicago. <laughs> some more fun stuff here. Yeah. And then Bethlehem Nativity products, where you have all these handmade wooden artifacts here. Yeah, let's take a look at these real quick just to get in there. And these are the things that people come here for. Like these are the oh, fun absolutely. things that they can, it's hard to find anywhere else. That's what uh, makes it unique, exactly. Mm -hmm. Like we have a lot of products here that you cannot find anywhere else. Sure. And we also make sure we have a variety of vendors so that you don't find the same product twice. Sure. Oh yeah. Well, mm -hmm. that's great. So mm -hmm. you're not seeing the same thing over and over at each booth. Mm -hmm. And then of course you have the ice skating rink here that mm -hmm. is open. Well, it's open when same this hours is open. as the Winterland, as the Crystal Market that is part of the Winterland at Gallagher Way. Mm -hmm. Dog friendly, which a lot of people ask us, so that might be a good information to know. Oh, so this is dog friendly. It is dog friendly, oh, very cool. and 
it's good for us too, the people yeah. are working here because we love to cuddle with the dogs once in a while. So. Absolutely. <laughs> and then you got people to bring their dogs. Yeah, and you got these beautiful views of the yes. ice skating rink right yes. here. And with the little trees in the background, so it's it's a great photo up too. And you just have these shops kind of laid out all around here, right? Like all including around, this one here. All with the same design with the mm -hmm. red and white striped wooden booth. And you can see more more unique and fun jewelry up here. Christmas music Express, playing, fantastic. Yeah, more sweets to try over here, of course. Oh, yeah, look at that. And more typical German items. You might have heard of Campus, right? Yeah, I've heard the not so good guy. Yeah, it's usually it's in a scary movie. <laughs> exactly, exactly. Yeah. So they always have fun decor up here. There he is, actually hiding behind. Krampus. See? Oh yeah. There he is. Well, that's a little scary. <laughs> <laughs> but then all these fun things here, and then we just kind of make our way down here. Yeah. Once you slide over here, so I can hear you. Obviously. Yeah, absolutely. And I am. You probably have heard of the typical German advent calendars, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I know you can buy them here too in the U.S. Mm -hmm. But what is very common in Germany is that you create your own ones for your loved ones. Oh, I didn't know so that. So you can put your own little gifts in there. You you know you have another one in the background or here. So that's how I grew up as a as a child. My parents oh, really? would make a little gift for me every day, like small things, candy or oh, you know, like lipstick or something. And you grew up in Germany, right? And I you moved to the states. And we found out earlier that we went to the same college. You're an ISU alum, right? <laughs> yeah, so you brought a little bit of the tradition here to the States, especially here in Chicago, yeah? Yes, absolutely. I mean, that's what makes it so authentic that we also have some Germans on the team. Absolutely. All right, so now we're on the other side of the skating rink and we got a whole other row of things to check out here, right? Absolutely. More handcrafted products yeah. right here. All the leather wallets and purses you can see. Beautiful as well, international. Um, and Mostly I'm, international things that we're seeing here. Is that how this? Um, works? it's a good mix of local and international products. Okay. Yeah, for sure. Oh, we got Christmas ornaments. Pers right yeah, there. you can personalize them here, so that's awesome too. Yeah, look at these. I mean, you can't. <laughs> uh, those are my favorites. Absolutely. Yeah, super cute. And actually, I just got a sweater here the other day. It keeps you very warm. <laughs> Pook. So that's what they call the sock heads. Unfortunately, he isn't wearing one right now, but usually they have their little sock heads on, and it's so funny. I wish Wait, they could. How do they, how they wear? Yeah, sock heads. No, no. Just, 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 sock heads. <laughs> but I want Welcome to the Canadian Sock Hat booth. This is a multi functioning, fully reversible sock hat. You can wear it like this for weekends, parties, but for more formal occasions, you reverse your sock hat oh. into the executive model weddings, funerals, bat mitzvahs, jubilees, jam jamborees, eulogies, New Zealand goat herder for all your shepherding needs, goat herder into the Turkish, vacations down to the Middle East, peel that down into the bowler, box hunting, royal weddings, five star dining, bowler with ear flaps, Captain Hook for Halloween, our tribute to the late great Ray Charles, sensory deprivation chamber, great for trains, planes, migraines, single Donald Trump comb over for the balding, that's the double Donald, aka the hot cross buns, that's two styles in one, you're welcome, but my personal style of choice today includes peeling the foot up into into the Robin Hood for any impending Hunger Games or archery lessons. And it also comes with its own flowchart, style guide, owner's manual as well. Never stop learning. Bob's Belgian Hot Chocolate is at Daily Plaza. They've been at the Naperville Market, the Milwaukee Market. So one of our vendors that's been with us for a couple of years. If you need some hot chocolate for the day, that's the right place to go to. Absolutely. And then Very it kind of just rounds out here. So we're going to head out to the... Oh, we got some, a couple more ornaments. Yes, ornaments. Of all places from Orlando, look at that. Yes, but actually the material is from Germany. Oh, wow. So he can give you the whole spiel how this glass is very durable and then um, it's all designed and handcrafted by him and his company yeah, so I'm just take a closer very look well designed, right? yeah very, very cool I just bought a flying pig earlier see there's another flying I mean, pig. everybody needs a flying pig right <laughs> <laughs> Absolutely. Absolutely. so we've hit all the corners all the corners a little photo booth there yep and of course the rock flat the bank cheese house Always a good photo op for a lot of people. They, a lot of people buy it and are just waiting to take their pictures and videos here because it looks so good yep. when they make the sandwich. Maybe we can see over there and the cheese is running down. Oh, yeah, at least you will definitely cheese. become hungry. Sure. Well, that's a lot of fun. Yeah. And this is as authentic as it gets. Oh, yes. And they also are at Daily Plaza and here in Wrigleyville. All right, so you could definitely get lost and spend hours in this place. Lila, thank you very much for walking me around. I appreciate it. Um, what are the hours again, and what's the best way for people to know about the uh, the, the hours and activities happening here? Yeah, absolutely. So the Chris Market at Wrigleyville is open daily until December 31st. So the hours differ on weekdays and on the weekends. So you can find the exact hours on our website, chrisknellmarket.com slash Wrigleyville. We're also on Facebook and Instagram. So all the information is everywhere. And then there are a lot of Gallagher Way activities taking place in the Winterland that is surrounding. Yeah, so this is in 
inside the winter land, right? The, correct, uh, correct. Including stuff happening at the hotel. I know they like wreath making, they got movies playing over at the hotel, which is just right over there, but it's all together in this one space, correct? Yes, correct. So you can see there's a big screen up there where they show holiday movies too, all the way up there. We have the ice skating right behind me, and there's also Santa's workshop taking place. Yeah, and also in that same building right there where uh, the, uh, the Brick House Tavern is and all that good stuff. Yes, so a lot of fun holiday entertainment for the whole family. Oh, and I forgot to ask, what's it cost to come in here, come to here? Best part, admission free. Admission free. Um, you, I'm, I'm assuming you have to get the rentals for the ice skates behind you, but outside of that, it's what you really want is what you pay for, right? Exactly. It's a, it's a great experience. You don't have to pay for the admission. You can walk around, stroll around, take in the smells, taste, and the sights of the Chris Kinder Market and get into the holiday spirit. Well, Lila, thank you very much. I appreciate you hanging out with me this morning. And uh, for people who want more information on this, Lila, what's the, what's the site again? It's chrisknellmarket.com. If you want to find out more about Wrigleyville, it's slash Wrigleyville. Fantastic. And I am T-B-A-R-N-A-S at WGNTV.com. If you have a suggestion for the Chicago scene, T-Bartis at WGNTV.com. Happy holiday season, everybody. Thank you, Lila. I appreciate Thank it. So oh, much. sorry. <laughs> Enjoy. <laughs>